Hi everybody, Beneza here again. Um, anybody who's seen my videos, and it's not that many people to be honest, um, uh, you know, in terms of, you know, views. Um, so, but anyway, I like to get fan packs, you know, and open them and obviously share what I get on YouTube. So, this video is a fan pack challenge. Um, I really would like to see um, what any professional sports teams, uh, individual professional sports players, um, regardless of the sport, um, would send. Um, and it doesn't have to be professional teams, it doesn't have to be professional players, um, it can be celebrities like Tom Hanks or Denzel Washington, um, Adam Sandler. Um, you know, university athletic teams, collegiate uh, athletic teams, um, brands like Nike and Adidas and Reebok, um, Dr. Martens. Um, let's see what Walmart and Target can send. Um, and basically, and but well, basically, what I would like to do is unbox the fan packs that. Um, these places or teams and individuals send and you know re review them and basically give the, the the businesses a bit of a plug and a review on their items um, also you know um, if you look at my or view my videos that are already up you know I, I'm box or unpack fan packs um i've had some good ones like from the phillies was a good one the new york knicks one that i had was really nice um i've had really bad bad ones like from the pelicans um and i only got six pocket schedules from the pelicans um i do apologize my i got peripheral neuropathy in my feet and my foot is really banging away at the moment um but anyway um, you know, um, maybe, uh, Samsung, you would like to send me a phone out to review, um, or a tablet to review, the same with, with Apple. Um, maybe you have a new item that is out and you would like me to unbox it and set it up and review it. I don't know how good the videos are going to be, so it really would be nice to get something like a GoPro camera or um, any or anything really. Um, maybe Cadbury's um, or Hershey's. You know, I don't mind what you guys send, um, but um, it's basically on the sole basis of you know, reviewing what you guys mail out, maybe something somewhere like Disney or Universal, you know, would like to send out, you know, tick, park up with tickets for four days and allow my wife and I and son to stay at a certain hotel for four, four days and five nights or whatever and review the hotel, review the parks, you know, because to be honest, if I, when I, if, let me get my words right, sorry guys, um, when I went to Magic Kingdom the first time in Orlando, stroke kissing me, um, it was really fun, but it's, rides at Magic Kingdom really are more for, you know, younger people, I like that cup. You know, it was you go around different countries and you sit down and watch a little show or something. You no, know, so Epcot, you know, for grandparents, you don't really want to go on the roller coasters or anything, but you you, you want to be part of the fun. Epcot might be somewhere for for older people, maybe forty upwards, maybe sixty upwards. You know, you just want to get a break. You're there. You all got you've all got park hopper tickets. 
but you don't really want to rush around to get to Space Mountain in the Magic Kingdom, and you don't want to sit on the safari at Animal Kingdom because it stinks, you know, because, you know, that. and I don't mind the smell. You know, you go around the safari, you see the different animals and whatever, and that kind of thing, for me, helps in terms of theme parks. Um, so maybe that's another fan pack that maybe Universal or Disney or a different theme park could send us. So I know um, we've been to other theme parks and some of my size cannot fit on the on, on the ride, whereas Disney I can. Um, but, and st for stuff like that, for b bigger people like me who like going on roller coasters and stuff, that kind of information helps. So for Disney and Universal and other theme parks alike, you know, those kind of reviews by average everyday people like myself, in my opinion, help. So, you know, even like something like a Samsung tablet, you know, or an Amazon Fire tablet. I just got an Amazon Fire tablet maybe two weeks ago, not maybe 10 days ago. And I like it. But the only thing is the, the touchscreen um, keyboard, you really have to pay attention to um, each character that you press because my fingers being so well, fat, thick, um, you know, either if I'm going to press A, sometimes I'll press S because my, I'm going so quick and my fingers are so big, you know, I press S instead, instead of A. So, you know, so those kind of reviews to me help, you know, who's got the big, bigger keyboard and is it better for me to get a seven inch in terms of a cut screen? keyboard or should I get a bigger 10 inch or 11 inch or whatever so you know also a lot of the team fan packs that I may get in terms of sports or you know and they may send a, a medium jersey I'm not going to wear a medium jersey so I might say well I got this medium jersey from the Seattle Seahawks if it's autographed I might keep it, um, or I might say, well, here's the giveaway, you know, if someone was, you know, um, happy enough to set, send me like $500 worth of stamps or $1,000 worth of stamps, you know, I'd package the, the Seahawks jersey, you know, and say, look, here's a giveaway. Um, the first person to comment um, you're the correct answer to a question you know who like what Ipswich Town player you know starred in es the Escape to Victory or whatever it's called with Sylvester Stallone the soccer um, movie and Pelé was in there I know, I know the answer because I'm an Ipswich Town fan and you know, it's John Walk. You know, so I I didn't see you all. <laughs> That's easy. I'm, I'm an Ipswich fan. Not many people will know about Ipswich because, you know, they're in the league below. They used to be in the Premier League, but they're in the league below Manchester United and Arsenal in the Premier League. So, you know, or something harder to get more views and comments. So, or something harder, something like that, you know, not a lot of people would know. So, and it's, it's a, an answer that you could Google pretty quickly. Um, but, you know, I wouldn't mind doing that if, you know, someone out there, like someone like James Harrison from the Steelers, said, I'll donate, you know, $500 worth of stamps or $1,000 worth of stamps, or, you know, because, you know, there's a lot of stuff, like I just got a, a, an autograph football uh, from Dan Marino. I think we just went to the Dolphins um, game against the Cardinals this Sunday, just gone. And I just happened to see him outside an elevator. So I went, rushed over and said, can you sign this please? Got a picture. You know, something like a Dan Marino football. If 
Bieber was like, don't sell it, keep it. And it's like, what? Because, well, I'm like, well, mm. and they're like, well, you know, my dad was saying, well, he he went to Pitt and he's from Pennsylvania and he went to high school in Pittsburgh or around P Pennsylvania somewhere. I said, oh, well, in that case, Simon, we're Pittsburgh fans and my dad grew up in and around Pittsburgh. Then it's, you know, that that's more of a reason to keep it. Um, with a connection to Pennsylvania, and that's where my fam, well, my dad's side of the family from, my pet, my mum's side of the family's from England. That's why I got an English accent. So, um, let's see. I'm gonna put this video on YouTube. Um, I might put post it on certain places. Um, on Facebook, maybe on Twitter. Um, and I really would, you know, you know, like to see. Um, people actually take up the fan pack challenge because you know I don't just want to do it for myself. I, I mean, there are selfish reasons to getting uh, Pittsburgh Steelers um, fan packs and Penguins fan packs and Pirates fan packs. You know, I would love an autographed jersey from James Harrison. You know. He's my, you know, favourite Steelers player of all time. Um, so to, to have an autographed jersey from him, it's highly likely that I'll get the, get it framed and hung up on a wall somewhere. Um, same as if, <coughs> excuse me, Starling Marte from the Pirates sent me an autographed jersey. That thing's going to get up the up on our wall somewhere as well. Same as if, if Sidney Crosby or if Jenny Malkin or anybody from the Penguins sent an autograph jersey. That's going to get up on our wall again in a frame. Especially if it's got their autograph on it. Especially if it's a whole team. Um, so, let's see. Um, this is a fan pack challenge. Um, as I said, teams. Um, if you want to send me season tickets, or you would like to send my family and I um, game tickets with pre-game field access to the home team side, um, with a free hotel stay to review your team. And see how great it is behind the scenes. You know, maybe we could come for the weekend. You know, someone from, say, the Steelers or the Seattle Seahawks on the Miami Vikings or um, the Tampa Bay Lightning for hockey. Um, you know, on the on a you know, we'll come the Friday night, um, and or even if I do it myself. You know. Um, you know, maybe for, send me a, a plane ticket, you know, come up, you know, the Friday night. Uh, maybe my son could come as well, although he doesn't really like sports, but it would be, be a cool experience for him, I think, as well. But he might be a bit grumpy about it because he's a teenager. And I was like that when I was a teenager. But um, let's see, you know, Steelers. Seahawks, uh, Vikings, Panthers, um, Tampa Bay Lightning, um, the New York Rangers, the Pittsburgh Penguins, any teams or professional teams that are, you know, playing at the moment, um, that would be, an, to me, an ultimate fan pack if you sent a plane ticket, a hotel stay, and, you know, behind the scenes access, you know, get some few, a few autographs and a free jersey. And meet a few players, you know, record us, you know, talking to them, asking a few questions, and uh, maybe you guys, if it, that does happen, um, maybe you can leave some comments in this video or any videos that might come up that, you know, the teams are doing this, you know, oh my god, see, you know, the, the Steelers are actually doing it for me, you know, they're actually flying me up there to stay there and do all this. Um, it, it, it's a pipe dream um, that can be made a reality. Um, 
and it'd be really cool to to do that. Um, so let's see what can happen. Um, Nike, send me some, you know, free items to try out. You know, um, I'll put this on Twitter um, and Facebook. Um, my name's Benjamin Joseph Powner. You can find me on Facebook. I don't mind you finding me on Facebook as long as you don't start, you know, sending me nasty messages and whatever else. It's it's all in good fun. Um, as I said, and I'll mention again, some of the stuff I will give away. So say um, the Minnesota Vikings, they contact me and Ben, uh, we would like to offer you, you know, a flight up to Minnesota um, for our game against such and such. We'll put you up in a hotel, we'll fly you here, you don't have to worry about food and drink and whatever, we'll feed you, um, you know, you know, review the city, you know, come in behind the scenes, meet some of the players, get some autographs and some jerseys and footballs and whatever. Um, here's some t-shirts to donate, um, here's X, Y and Z to donate to people, do a video, you know, I'll, I'll try and video video some stuff with the laptop I've got and the Amazon Fire that I've got, um, that I've actually got autographed by, um, Frosty Rocker and, um, I can't remember the other guy's name, Minter, something Minter from the Arizona, the Arizona Cardinals that I got autographed the other day at the Miami Dolphins game in Miami against the Arizona Cardinals. So, so again, Samsung, GoPro, if you'd like to send me a tablet to use to, to video all that stuff, um, you know, you know, if the Minnesota Vikings or any sports team decide to say, well, come, we'll put you up in a hotel from Friday till Monday. You know, you can come in, you know, Friday night, maybe meet some people, do some behind the behind the scenes stuff. Saturday, you know, same again, go out, review the local area. Um, you know, maybe you know, give me a $500 Visa gift card to review the area for restaurants and whatever else and, you know, see how you get to and from the uh, stadium, you know, you know, do some recording around the stadium and whatever else, you know, maybe Saturday, come in, meet some of the players, if there's some players there, meet some of the staff, game days, maybe Sunday, you know, meet some more staff, meet more players and whatever else. And you know, um, watch the game, you know, pre game field access and whatever else, and you know, fly home mon the Monday and bring whatever I bring home with me that I got from the Vikings or whatever, maybe some t shirts and jerseys and signed cleats and whatever else, and you know, I. Basically, if, say they gave me a thousand dollar piece of gift card to use to get around. Leave some money on there and send some of the stuff out that they gave me to people that have watched the videos. Um, you know, I, I think that would be pretty cool. You know, um, <clears throat> you know, to be able to mail out someone. And or their son or their daughter, an autographed Vikings t shirt. You know, you've watched my videos, you commented, you know, the five hundredth person or the, the hundredth person who's commented commented on the on um a video for the Vikings, you'll get you'll get the autographed extra large t shirt. What's your address? You know, and I'll mail it out to you. So I think that stuff kind of is something that I would enjoy doing, you know, going to meet these people at these teams, 
even celebrities. Say Denzel Washington was promoting a new movie, and I went to interview him. I know he gets interviewed all the time, but maybe, you know, you could leave some questions for him, and, you know, I could get some autographed items from him, and say, look, you know, I do these YouTube videos, and I would like to do a giveaway, you know, you know, obviously keep an autograph from him myself because he's one of my favourite actors, my three, one of my top two up actors of all time. So, well, three, I guess. Um, so that would be cool to do. So, you know, Samsung, Chicago Bears, Pittsburgh Steelers, uh, James Harrison, uh, Sony, uh, Walt Disney, uh, Universal, um, Hard Rock Cafe. Um, Hard Rock Hotel and whatever else, uh, Hilton Hotels, you know, maybe you'd like to offer me free stays at your hotel um, anywhere when I, when I uh, um, do this kind of thing, um, or just to review your hotels, I guess. Um, let's see what can happen, might, people might think this is a silly idea. People might think, well, let's see what you can do. It'd be cool. But anyway, uh, thank you for watching. I know it's a bit of a long video, but um, I really, I would really appreciate it. You know, because I'd like to meet someone like James Harrison or Larry Larry Fitzgerald from the Cardinals, or you know, Denzel Washington or Adam Sandler or Ser Serena Williams is another one. I would love to meet and her sister Venus, um, Dwayne Rock Johnson, um, anybody from wrestling basically from WWE, Triple H and Bailey and Charlotte and um, Roman Reigns, John Cena, Undertaker, all that, you know, all those kind of th people I would love to meet. You know, I'd love to be in the front row of a rest, uh, wrestling show, whether it be Raw or SmackDown or one of the pay per views with, you know, sit next to Mick Foley uh, uh, Mick Foley lives in the same city as we do or he has a house here and he was in the Home Depot the other day and you know how badly I would have loved to meet that guy because we grew up watching him um, and people might think well why do you want his autograph he's just another an average person just like all of us and I agree but you know, the amount of work someone like Mick Foley or James Harrison or Denzel Washington put into what they do to entertain us, you know, for us to have something to watch, to entertain us, you know, to make us laugh, to make us cry, to make us feel good, you know. I watch WWE wrestling because it, I enjoy it, and that's what it, and that's why it's called WWE, World Wrestling Entertainment, because it's to entertain people. Um, I would have loved to have a wrestling career or f a football career. Um, I never got the chance to. So, someone like Mick Foley and James Harrison, Robin Williams, Denzel Washington, Adam Sandler, uh, Antonio Brown. And anybody else, you know, that's my kind of thing that I like. So, you know, to meet these people, to ask them questions, ask them questions that you might have um, would be so cool. Um, but we'll have to wait and see what happens. Thank you for watching. I don't know if anything will ever come of it, but we'll have to wait and see, won't we? Um, Anybody who is interested, whether it's an individual or a team or a company like Nike or any Dr. Martins or Disney theme parks or Universal theme parks or, you know, um, Universal Studios, you'd like to invite me to one of your movies and have a bit part and, you know, meet the stars and get autographs and everything and, you know, you know, that would be cool to me as well. So, um, please contact me on Twitter. If you're watching this on Twitter, contact me on Facebook. Um, 
if you're watching this via Facebook, um, as I said, Benjamin Joseph Powner is my name. You'll find me on Facebook that way. Um, my surname is P-O-W-N-E-R. So Benjamin Joseph Powner. Uh, Twitter, I'm Beneza, B-E-N-E-Z-A-H. So comment on here as well. And I'll just give you an email address to set, uh, email me as well. Um, thank you for watching. Bye.